Hi, it's Jeff Londash and welcome to Out and About. And today we're gonna feature one of the finest things to do in the community every year. I'm sure you've heard about it, maybe you've participated in it, and maybe you haven't, but this year you should. And it's the Panerathon, and it, it does wonders for an area community place like the Joni Abdu Comprehensive Breast Care Center. And today I'm here with Candice from Mercy Health. How are you? I'm good, Jeff, how are you? I'm I'm, I'm fantastic. And the two Julies, go ahead and introduce yourselves. Hi, Julie Julie. And I'm Julie Payton. All right, now we're going to talk about the Panerathon first. What a wonderful event. I run. I, I love the fact that, that it's put on every year and the money goes to a good local charity. But let's talk about the dates and the times of Panera. This is the eighth year already. Yes, so this is the eighth annual Panerathon. This year it's on Sunday, August 27th. It's at the Cavelli Center in downtown Youngstown and the uh, 10K two mile portion begins at 10 a.m. We also have a kids run that's sponsored by PNC and that begins at 11.30. Okay, and a 10K for you to out there, that's about six miles. 6.2 miles. 6.2, <laughs> gotta get the point two because of the <laughs> kilometer, the thing that we never studied in school and don't know about. But it's not very long, but you could walk this, you could run this. This is not something where if you're not a, a seasoned runner and you're out doing it for time, it's still a wonderful day to come out and take a great walk. It is definitely. About 85% of the people who participate in the event do the two miles. Um, but we definitely encourage people to come out and run the 10K. You can walk the 10K. That portion of the event is timed, so you'll be able to track yourself through the race. Okay, and there's a lot of activities going around in the area beforehand. Yes, we have a vendor area set up in the back. We will actually have the mobile mammography unit on site that morning, so you'll be able to tour the uh, the unit and uh, make appointments to be seen at the center if you need to. We have a whole kids area that has bounce houses. Um, Marco's Pizza will be there serving pizza, and they bring all of their characters. There's a lot of fun things for kids and families. So now, and and what's really nice is I, I I love how the fact that people get together and do this as teams. They just don't do this by themselves. Some people go and and walk it or run it on their own, but they get together for teams to help raise money. That's correct. Every year we have such great success with our teams. Uh, Sweeney Chevrolet. YSU Nursing for a Cure, they're two of our largest teams. Last year, Sweeney had almost 180 people. The uh, nice thing about it is if anybody has a team of five or more people or just five people that want to do the event together, you actually get discounted registration. So it's only $20 per person versus 30 for the 10K or 25 for the two mile. I've done a lot of 10Ks, and 20 or $25 for a registration is nothing. I mean, some of the 10Ks in Cleveland and Pittsburgh can be anywhere from 100 to $250. So this is just a nominal amount to, to run or walk. That's correct. And 100% of the registration fee and sponsorships goes directly to benefit uh, the Joni Abdu Comprehensive Breast Care Center. All of that money stays in our community, and you can really see the impact that it makes. Let's talk about the Cavelli Enterprises, because it's a Thing that they do and this is part of how you give back as a corporation to our community. Right. Our partnership with Cavelli Enterprises is so wonderful. Um, for the past seven years, we've worked with them to create and, you know, maintain the Panerathon. We're so grateful for their partnership. We wouldn't be able to do what we do without their support. And when it first started in the very first year, the funds that were raised went to the, the Komen Foundation. And then it was decided that we wanted to keep this here. And tell, give this the history of, of Joni Abdu now. That's correct. Um, this center was created with the vision of Dr. Rashid Abdu. He lost his wife to a very aggressive form of breast cancer and promised her that he would create a center where women didn't have to travel to Cleveland or Pittsburgh to receive treatment. Um, we never thought that it would take off the way that it did and being able to unveil the Mammo van last year at Panerathon was heartwarming and you know something that we can definitely show as a symbol of what we've done with uh, what we've received from Panerathon. 
And, and how much money has been raised through the first seven years? We've raised $1.6 million wow, to benefit the Joni Abdu Center. So the programs and services of the center and the uh, mobile mammography unit. And that's all through sponsors and through all the registrations and the runners and the groups raising donations. That's correct. We encourage all of our teams to create fundraising pages to uh, raise money outside of just their registration fee. But people are so generous and we're so grateful for all the support that we receive, whether through volunteering or monetary donation. That's a phenomenal thing you do. So let's talk a little bit about registration again, because this runs during the entire month of August and you are on the 27th, correct? That's correct. It's Sunday, August 27th. An important date to remember if you do want the dry fit t-shirt, which is our technical t-shirt, the deadline to register is Friday, August 18th. So you can register through the day on Friday, but that's our cutoff for the dry fit. Otherwise you will get a, um, a cotton shirt, but this year the color is electric blue. Electric blue. So, so they, and what was it last year? Last year they were red. They were oh, and we're not gonna have no. But we're not gonna have a fight here now. It's okay. <laughs> All right. So people up now. What if they decide between that drop dead of the 17th for the dry fit and the day of? Can they can they register the day of? They can register the day of. Uh, we will be on site that morning, beginning at 8 a.m. to do registration. So if you want to wait till the last minute, you're able to make that decision that day. Okay. So you correct. You stop me whenever I screw this up. So you could. The registration starts at 8 a.m. on the 27th. The races start at 10 a.m. So what time can people actually get there? We recommend getting on site early. Uh, there's not actually parking at the Cavelli Center, so you'll have to use the flat lots and parking garages downtown. A lot of people end up showing up around 9 o'clock just to get together with their teams, take pictures, walk around. And then the 10K, if you're walking that, it that could take you, um, let's see, 15 minutes, about an hour and a half. Yep, that's correct. Usually people are back at the center by 1130, and that's when our kids race portion of it begins. Okay. And then the day kind of ends at? Around noon. Oh, Charlie's is on site uh, with food, so 100% of the $5 fee that it is to eat in the Oh, Charlie's tent goes directly to the Joni Abdu Center as well. So they have chicken fingers, french fries, pasta, all kinds of things to fill you up after they have the race. The, the best chicken fingers in the world, too. Okay, so the Panerathon, you can register up until the day of the Panerathon on August 27th. And ladies and gentlemen, this is something for the entire family. Bring your children with you. If you can't do the 10K, everybody in your family could do the two-mile walk. You're going to raise money for a wonderful organization, the, the Joni Abdu Breast Care Center uh, up by Mercy Hospital, the St. E's on Belmont Avenue. And again, all the money that's raised here goes right here and stays in our valley. It's a wonderful day. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of fun things to do that day, vendors, food, the whole bit. It's a great thing for the family. Now we're going to talk about the Joni Abdu Comprehensive Breast Center. I'm just going to call you Julie 1 and Julie 2 if that's okay with you. Julie 1, this van behind us is incredible. I, I was um, through the Cavalia Enterprises in a Panerathon. This was made available where women, you go to different communities where women actually can't come to a place like this and right on site you have everything in here that could give them a mammogram. That's absolutely correct. Um, the inside of the van looks exactly like the Joni Abdu Center. It was created that way. It's the same healing atmosphere, the exact same state-of-the-art equipment that is used in the center. So we, act, we call it Joni on the go. <laughs> And Julie, number two, I, I was really stunned too that the amount of of actual um, exams that you do in this per year is it's astounding. Yeah, absolutely. We serviced um, 1,200 women this year um, on the Mammo van. We serviced um, three counties: Columbiana, um, Trumbull, and um, Mahoning Valley. Yeah, so it's a, it's a wonderful thing, and the women really love it. So, and, and this will go through those counties, and, and what happens, like, do you, do, you, are you, do you have scheduled events, or could someone at a corporation, say, or a, a lodge or whatever, schedule you to come in? Absolutely. We service about 100 um, primary care practices and organizations um, just this year. So we have, the van runs three days a week and we'll service about two locations a day. Um, and we're already booked until about February 2018 and we booked in January for that. So we're really excited to be able to, you know, provide this service to everybody. 
That's incredible. And how long does uh, a mammogram take? It takes about 15 minutes. Um, we encourage pre-registration for all of our sites. That way, when you get on the van, we have all of your paperwork and we're ready to go. And Okay, and we know the van is a wonderful thing, but let's talk about the center a little bit, too. This, if Because this is so booked up now, if they would like to come here and make the um, appointment to come here, what's the protocol for that? You know, just call the center. Our number is 330 Four eight zero two six five four, and you know, for clarity, we certainly the van is running three days a week. If there is particular organizations or special events, we have provided service more than three days a week. So, if someone is truly interested in having the van on site or for a community, um, you know, event, please feel free to call the center, and we can certainly see what we can do to help service that event. Okay. And uh, Julie, number two, how long once uh, the mammogram is taken? How long does it take to get results on that? Um, our results come back, um, takes about 24 hours from the MAMO van. Um, the physician will read them. If there is any problems, um, we will call the patient directly. If not, we will send them a letter saying we will see you next year plus a day for their next screening. Do you think that is one van enough for us in this area? Do you ever think you're going to go uh, and move it up to two? Is there a necessity for that? Certainly possibility as we continue to grow. Wow. It's amazing. Over 1,200 women have gone through this this year. And that, that's a wonderful thing that all of you are doing for the Valley. So let's wrap this, uh, this out and about up here. August 27th, the Panerathon, one of the finest events that you could be a part of in the Valley. Take your family, take your friends, get a team. Uh, Candace, they could go to a website also, right? Panerathon.org is the website. You can register individually by teams. You can sign your kids up there. It's our comprehensive site. Okay, uh, a 10K, a two-mile walk run, and also the kids run. Correct, that's correct. And, and food and vendors and fun, it's something that you really should be a part of in Mahoney Valley. This is something that, that uh, a lot of women could benefit from. We've, you've raised an incredible amount of money through the first seven years, and there's a long way to go because as long as there's breast cancer, there needs to be a Panerathon, correct? That's correct. All righty. That's going to do it for this uh, edition of Out and About. Please, get, get out on August 27th. Enjoy the Panerathon. Running's a good thing. So is walking, and so is having fun with your family. So Julie 2, Julie 1, Candice, thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you all at the Panerathon on August 27th. You take care and have a great day. <laughs>